Yo, good morning, y'all. This is your boy Garrett Spencer. How's everyone? How's everybody doing? Today's Saturday. Y'all know what today is. Um, start off with the shout out. So, first person I'm gonna give a shout out to is um some new faces, SL Game Gaming Deck. SL Gaming Deck. Um I uh, appreciate your comment yesterday on my Simpsons Road Rage uh, gameplay. Um, I'm glad you enjoyed it. So SL Gaming Deck. Next we have is a uh, is a uh, Dave and Hiskey. Dave and Hiskey. I um, appreciate you as well. Um, you know, appreciate you watching the uh, gameplay yesterday and commented on there as well. So Dave and Hiskey. Third person I'm gonna give a shout out to is um Calvin Jr. Calvin Jr. Um, uh, check him out. You know, funny, entertaining, likes to dance and make people laugh. And um, game room's looking really uh, stunning, um, Calvin, so keep doing your thing. Fourth person, give a shout-out to, and a special thanks, Dr. Josh, the real gamer, of course. Another person, give a shout-out to, is uh, Lightsaber Samurai. Lightsaber Samurai, check him out. You know, cool person, good people, has a good channel, does videos and live streams sometimes. Another person, Brian Trusty. Brian Trusty, you know, another um, cool person, good channel, um, very professional on his uh, uh, live streams and whatnot. So, Brian Trusty, another person, One Up Woman, One Up Woman, um, another cool person, um, has a good channel, does live streams with herself, sometimes her family. Another person, TB Cutie, TB Cutie, um, check her out, um, nice person, good channel, does review videos and comes through, and good people. Another person, another person is a uh, Rockstar Nick 2000. Rockstar Nick 2000, another cool person, uh, good people, another supporter, and um, another good gamer. Another person is uh, another person is a uh, Filippo. Filippo, check him out. Cool person, good channel, does live streams and whatnot, and comes through. Another person, Chauncey Talon. Chauncey Talon, cool person, good people, another another uh, good gamer, and uh, comes through. Uh, another person is a uh, Chad the Gaming Dad. Chad the Gaming Dad, uh, good channel. Um, another uh, cool gamer. Um, uh, and is a nice person. Another person is a uh, in Borderline. In Borderline. Um, uh, check him out. Good people. Um, good channel. And um, another uh, another good gamer. Another person is um. Uh, what's his name? Folk Raven Bear. Folk Raven Bear, check him out. A uh, cool person, uh, another good gamer, another good channel, and um, good people. And um, another another person, another person we're gonna give another person we're gonna give a shout out to is J Love eighty one. J Love eighty one, um, cool person, a uh, good channel, got some good review videos and does live streams. Another person is a uh, Alpha Nerd Entertainment. Alpha Nerd Entertainment. Uh, Another uh, cool dude, another good channel, got some good review videos, does live streams once in a while, and he's very professional on his channel, makes you feel like he's on, you're on TV. Um, another person give a shout out to is Joe Quimperides, Joe Quimperides, um, check him out, you know, cool, guy, cool person, uh, another good supporter, good people, and uh, also into video games as well. Um, and... And um, another person give a shout out to is uh, Retro Gaming Star. Retro Gaming Star, check him out. He's a nice dude. He's a good person. Uh, you know, good channel. Very positive. Um, does review. Does um, a lot, little bit of live streams and also you know just regular videos. So Retro Gaming Star. Another person give a shout out to Ocean JA. Ocean JA, check her out. Um, nice per nice person. Um, he has a good channel. Does live streams and. And um, you know, like um, just like family, like a sister to me. So Ocean J A. Uh, and as uh, far as far as everybody else goes, want to say thank you guys and welcome. And you know, you know, glad to have you guys. And hope you guys continue to watch the videos. So thank you. So um, you know that that takes care of that. So today's Saturday, of course, six day of the week. Got it in, got it, got it, you know, got a good lifting in the weight room this morning, and then went out, cut the grass, and just uh, relaxing after I had my coffee and made some uh, cream of wheat for breakfast, and I uh, did my breathing exercises, like you know, meditations, whatnot. So, um, yeah. So what I'm gonna get into, what I'm gonna get into today, another uh, um, 
as as some other game is um is just happens to be a PC games that was from the nineties um on the um on this uh, on the computer the mo the mo dos on um, PC games you know back in the nineties like you know you know that that's another those are some other games back in the nineties I remember because I remember playing my uh my granddad um. Grandma and Granddad, they had that computer with all the MODOS games on there, and um, some of the games that um that I just happened to like, you know, one of the game, some of the good games that I played on that game was uh God of Thunder. I was kind of like an action puzzle game in a way, but it, I found it to be pretty good. Another game that I, another game I found on there that happened to be pretty good was called Raptor basically an airplane shooting game, you know, now at first when you looked at the background, you could see the water, and um, at first, it, at first on um, when you, you know, it looks like, a, it looks more like a person on a jetpack, you know, just shooting airplanes, but it actually, it's actually an airplane, it's actually an airplane though, but you know, I didn't really know it at the time, I thought it was a guy in a jetpack in a way, but that would be kind of dangerous though, but yeah, Raptor, that was a good game. Another game that um I found on that you know I liked on there was um Epic Pinball. Um that Epic Pinball game on there was on um, was uh, pretty good was on um, pretty good, you know, nice graphics, good gameplay, um nice movement and um you know, very good. Um another game that I may have played once but don't really recall is uh Jill Jill of the Jungle. Now Jill of the Jungle, that was a good game. Um that was a good game, um, you know, Jill um could pick up a knife and throw it at your uh, throw it at your enemies and um, go down tubes and you know do all kinds of stuff. Joe of the Jungle that was a good game. And another game that was uh, that another game on the PC that was okay. It's called Monster Bash now. Monster Bash it's kind of like one of those game. It's kind of one of those games like you know like if you if you turn the lights off and you're sitting by yourself you're sitting by yourself in the dark with or without the lights on. You know, it's it, it might feel a little. You know, it's one of those um monster games that could be a little scary, especially you're sitting by yourself, and uh, somebody like comes, you know, sneaks up on you and like taps you as you know as a joke, and you go, like, oh, you know, it's kind of like one of those kind of games called Monster Bash. And um, uh, what other game did I like? Oh yeah, another game that was actually pretty good. Now they had a Chris, they had a. A, re a regular version of it, and they had a Christmas version of it. I didn't know too much about the Christmas version until I um seen the um seen this uh you know this uh CD -ROM, these uh, the, the PC disc called the Empire Games that had all kinds of games on there. But um it, it, the game it's the game that has the regular version and the Christmas version. It's called Jetpack, and basically how that game is basically you're a guy you're a guy on a jetpack now um. You know, um, you can't you can't throw or shoot in, you can't throw or shoot anything at the enemies, but you could fly you could fly on your jetpack and you gotta collect all the green um, all the green uh whatever they're called you know to um pass the um pass the mission and move on to the next after you go out the door to open that door so you go out there and you know to move on to the next level. But what you can do with those in what you can do to enemies though, like I don't know what that blue thing is. It might be kind of it, it might be some kind of a saw. Where you can uh, cut through the um, cut through the red um, the, the red walls, and like if your enemy um comes after you, and it, and the wall starts uh, the wall starts to close up, and the enemy's still there, it could uh, it could squish him up, and he gets stuck right just like that. So that I mean that's what that's, that's like the only thing you could do with the enemies on that game. And um, what else? Yeah, another and another game and um. And another game that I also found pretty good. I can't remember the name of it, but um, it's it's a, it's like a snake game where you know, as you're, you're a snake and um, you go. It's kind of like Miss Pac-Man, but you're a snake. Um, he starts off really starts off really little as he eats stuff as he eats stuff without hitting anything or anybody. Um, he he his uh he, he begins to grow as he keeps on as he keeps on eating. He goes around eating stuff. I think it's called Nibbles or something. But it's that it's a really good it's a really good snake game. Like whereas he keeps he goes around keeps eating stuff. Then um he gets then his body gets longer and longer and longer. But you just got to be careful not to hit anything. So I mean, 
So I mean, yeah, those was those were like I said, those those were the good times, man. On on the uh, PC, um, on the uh, on PC games, whatnot back then in the nineties, around the same time when Sega when Sega Genesis and um Nintendo was famous and whatnot. Yeah, that's those are some pretty good PC games, and um, you know, that's the M that's the MODOS um PC games version, and then like you know um the another um. And other games that, and, uh, and I could talk about the other games too. Yeah, you know what? I could talk about the other one next time though. But yeah, but the MOS, the MODOS games, man, that, those bring back mad memories, man. Those mad memories. Every time we would, every time moms would tell us we were going over to the hill over our grandma's house, you know, I'd be just wanting to get on that computer and play, um, on that computer and play them games, man. But like, you know, they didn't let me play, get on there and play too early, but. You know, like later on in the evening or afternoon, they you know we were allowed to get on there and play. But those those brought back some mad mad memories though. And then what I found out though, I didn't know anything about it though. Like Mortal Kombat just happened to be part of the MODOS uh, PC games. I didn't know nothing about that. Though. I'm like, what? I didn't know nothing about Mortal Kombat being a part of that though. But I'm just like, wow. Wow, man. Like the yeah. end. And there was other games too that I can't. You know that um. I've played on it that I could hardly um that I could hardly remember though, but I tell you, man, um, that that the, I mean that M O D O S uh, PC games, man, they brought back mad memories from the '90s, and like I said, I'll talk about the other PC uh, games uh next time, but that's all I pretty much got to say. But I hope you guys uh, but I hope you guys uh enjoyed this video. If so, y'all know what to do. This your boy Garrett Spencer. You guys take it easy. And I'll see you guys. I, I hope to see you guys later on, if not next week. Peace and I'm out. But remember, y'all, once a gamer, always a gamer. Keep on gaming, y'all.